Hey guys, it's Darcy Simmer, and welcome back to part 6 of 13 Ghosts. I know the last part was a little rough, but hopefully today's a little better. I'm feeling a lot better. I'm feeling pretty excited. And, uh, where is Avalon? Okay, she's cooking. So I'm gonna have her eat, and then, um, I guess we can work a little bit on her aspiration. What does she need? Achieve level 4 fitness skill and push limits for one hour while energized. So that will be helpful. Does she have a shower though? I should probably get her a shower so she can get energized, but uh, I can't be bothered right now. Sorry if I'm sniffly. I was out at like, <laughs> well, my little sister call texted and wanted me to go out to eat with her at like two o'clock in the morning and we were out till four o'clock in the morning and it was really cold so I'm a little sniffly today she doesn't normally call me at two o'clock in the morning to go out to eat but uh she had a craving for hamburger and fries and she's pregnant and didn't want to go by herself so I went with her and I didn't get back home till four o'clock and it was really really cold so I'm sorry if you could hear me sniffling I'm trying to cut out as much of it as I can so it's not too gross for you guys. Anyway, today we are going to work on her aspiration a little bit. We're going to go out and find her um, a person. Hopefully male so that she can go ahead and have the baby. And then the baby will probably be born in the next part. Because Saturday's videos are a bit longer. So she should have it then. And then she could find it with the book of life and someone else because Saturdays we are going to hunt for two sims also I'm sorry if you guys can hear fish tank noises in the background uh, the water has gone down a little bit I tried to fill it up as much as I could before recording so you couldn't hear it too much but um, I have to well I have to wait for my boyfriend to get home to treat the water because I don't know how to do it and I tend to kill fish so it's probably best if I don't do it so we're going to go down here and let her run on the treadmill for a little bit. And, hang on, could she like exercise to get work, worked up? Ugh, what am I trying to say? Energized, that's the word. Probably not. Uh, let's have her watch sports maybe. See if that gets her a little energized. Probably won't, but at least it'll get her fun up. Anyway, yesterday, well today for me, yesterday for you. Um, another build went up for, it, well, it was a build that I was going to use for the Let's Play. Still not sure if I'm going to use it or not. But, um, it was going to be a speed build, but I accidentally deleted the footage for it. So, ended up being a house tour instead. I don't know how I accidentally deleted the footage, because I remember going over everything. And I'm like, okay, this is the part where it ends. I need to keep that. But apparently I deleted it and then deleted it from my recycle bin and... I couldn't get it back so you got a house tour instead so I'm gonna have her work out for a little bit and then I guess we'll go somewhere what does she need to achieve level four how far is she she's still got quite a ways to go so I think I'm gonna skip this little bit for a while and I'll get back to you guys after she's got like at least level four fitness maybe or she's fatigued whichever comes first Okay, so I brought her to the gym because her social was really low, so... No, she's not going to do this. She's fatigued. Okay. Well, then I guess we'll just talk to this guy. Um, you know, her social's pretty low, so I decided I'd just go ahead and bring her out to a community lot to meet some people. I'd really like to find um, a guy for her to... Um, have a baby with clumsy childish and bro okay he doesn't have any of the traits we need for a lover goofball neat and active she hasn't I don't think she has anything that we need actually uh yeah she does she's got the body trait so I mean I guess I could use her but you know we'll just look around see if we can find anybody else uh what about you come here come here Stop being a sad panda. Come here. Click. I clicked. 
uh, cheerful introduction. What's your name? Anyway, Keaton Cortez. Isn't uh, one of the other ones she has named Cortez? Yeah, Emery. Emery Cortez. As you can see, Emery and Alexandria are still alive. There's Alexandria. Just for the hell of it. That makes me laugh every time. I don't know why I keep getting text messages. Leave me alone. Uh, did I learn about him? No, I did not. She didn't introduce herself. No, not flirty. Jesus. Um, cheerful. Bookworm neat and gloomy. I don't think I need any of that. No, it doesn't look like it. Well darn. Oh, what about you? Come here, come here, come here, come here. Ah. Uh, for the introduction. Stop talking to them. Let's go. Come on. Evil hates children outgoing. I don't... Do I need an evil Sam? I don't think I do. No, it's just mean that I need. Yeah. What else does he have? Evil hates children outgoing. She's not any of those. I don't think any of these people have anything she has. No, 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 no. Okay. Oh, him. Yes. He's non-committal, music level, lover, and active, so all three of his traits would go for something. Non-committal, yeah, so that will go for the lust trait. So I think I'm just going to use him for that one. And that'll work. And she can make babies with him. He is single, so I think I'm going to um, ask him back to her home. Where, what am I doing? Oh yeah. Uh, where is he? What was his name again? Anthony Bello, maybe? Yeah. Yeah. So, we're gonna take him back home. And I'll see you guys there. Here we are. And it is already 8 o'clock. Bright and day. I guess I should probably get our relationship up with him first. Um, I may end up locking him in my basement so he doesn't leave. I'll probably, uh, yeah, I'm going to do that, definitely. Um, I'll also have to take a picture of him, actually. Take a photo of Anthony Bello. Skip through this a little bit. There we go. He smells really bad, though, so. Or is that me? I think it's both of us. Yeah, it's definitely both of us, unless it's... Stench is just chilling along, but no, it, it, it's both of us. What is this? What is this pose? No. What are you doing? Check, 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 check a different picture. Oh, he's smelly. What is... Well, he's going to have stench in his picture. He's like, oh, yes. Brighton. Boop. 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 Oh, that is so disgusting. The stench coming off of him is... Um, I'm, I can't remember what I was talking about. Um, let me unlock this so that he could get through and then chat here. And then I'm probably gonna have her use this bathroom and take a shower and everything. And then let him try to take a shower down here, lock door for everyone but Avalon. Sorry, guy, but it's something I gotta do. And while he's down here, um, I'll let him out whenever I decide to make it a babies with him. So I'm just gonna sit down here and talk for a little while, I guess. Oh, uh, well. You know what? I'm gonna take care of her needs and everything and let her go to sleep for the night. And I'll see you guys in the morning whenever we're back with Anthony Bello. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just gonna have her go ahead and graft this dragon fruit onto the snapdragon and hopefully get the cow plant berry, cow berry seed, whatever it's called. Let's see. Yeah, cow berry. So that will be helpful. And have her use the bathroom. She needs some fun, so I guess I'll have her uh, watch a little bit of TV before going downstairs. Oops, he, I gave him some apple pie, but he won't eat it for whatever reason. Let's clean up his cell a little bit. Alright, and she also likes to come down here and eat with him. Well, she sits on this bench and eats. 
while he's in here just staring at her. So that's kind of weird, but whatever floats her boat. So, I don't know why she's not sitting in a chair, but okay. She didn't even use the bathroom. What is wrong with her? Why is she watching sports, I guess, maybe? Yeah, it looks like it's the sports channel. Still waiting for Emery and Alexandria to die. I don't think they're... Yeah, no, she's still alive. We're despised and enemies. And Alexandria will probably be alive for a little bit longer because she's still just a young adult. So, there's that. Um, her phone's up good enough. So just let her use the bathroom. Then we'll go down here and talk to Anthony some more. So, the people upstairs have just got back home. So, you might hear some stomping and screaming and stuff. And I just can't help that. I uh, try to cut those parts out. I can't cut all of them out because sometimes I don't really hear it through the headphones, so I'm like talking over it. But I will try my best to cut out all those parts. Um, let's go ahead and do some romantic interactions. I think I've already asked him if he was single, but you know, that's fine. Flirt. Um, compliment appearance, I guess. He likes it, so that's good. Um, pickup line maybe? You may not like that. You ain't going nowhere, guy. You can't go anywhere. You're locked in my basement. Um, exchange numbers. And then we will flirt with him some more. I don't know what she's doing now. She's on her phone. Oh, right, they're exchanging numbers. Okay. I'm not going to ask a risky question because they don't usually like that. Um, I can embrace him, why not? And then, uh, I don't want to make a move right now. Um, snuggle. No. Bold pickup line, she's feeling pretty confident, so why not? Totally digging me. <laughs> How hot does their relationship have to be before they're able to woohoo, though? Um, embrace him again. Because they don't really get as bored with social interactions in this. I think I've only had to see him get bored once from using the same social interaction over and over again. But then again, that could have been The Sims 3 and I'm just not remembering right. You never know. Anyway, uh, he has to be her boyfriend, so I'll go ahead and do that. And then to have their first kiss. So I guess he's not going to be her boyfriend. <laughs> anyway, what I was saying is in reality, he probably wouldn't be very into her, you know, being locked in her basement and all, but, you know, this is The Sims, they could do that, it's fine. Um, suave kiss, so let's get their relationship up a little bit more, flirt with him, and, I mean, we could woohoo in a bush, but I feel like he might escape if I let him outside, so there's that, which reminds me, I'm gonna have to lock my doors. I don't know where my gardener is. I know I hired one, but that one's still locked, right? Yeah. And then, okay, lock for everyone but Avalon. And then, sweet talk. And we will ask him to be her boyfriend again. And then I will unlock this so that they can Okay, so now he's her boyfriend, so she can bind him to a book of life. And then we'll go ahead and try for baby up here. And the thing with the baby is that you're allowed to age it into a child, but you can only keep it in your house for 24 hours before you have to move it out. So, once, it, once I age it up to a baby, I am going to send it to the orphanage. I'm just going to go into manage households and move it over to the orphanage. And then I can go ahead and bind a book to the baby as well. And then when this is done, I guess I can let him go home. Because I don't really need him anymore. Um, unlock. Well, unless she's not pregnant, then I guess I do need him. So let me go ahead and lock that again, just in case. Everyone but Avalon. Ah, oh, waited too late. Oh well, I can always call him back over later. Yay, she's pregnant, so I guess I don't need him anymore. So I'm going to have her eat and then sleep and then write a book of life to go ahead and bind Antony. And I'll see you guys in just a bit. 
Alright, she's just working on her other book of life so I can bind Anthony to it. And then she's gonna go pay her bills and stuff, and then I guess that will probably be it for this episode. So, let's see. She's got a little ways to go still. She, okay, the gardener showed up, so that's good. I guess he doesn't come on Sundays then. Or he just doesn't uh, show up whenever she goes somewhere. I don't know. Anyway, so we're just gonna have to finish this up a little bit. And she's gonna have a baby. Eat the fly. There you go, Sir Edgar. I really like having these as pets because I don't have to feed them. So that's always a plus. Not that I don't feed my actual pets. I do feed them. It's just... In The Sims, I don't like having to feed them all the time. And they usually die. Well, not only that I don't like feeding them, but I forget to feed them. And then they die. Like in The Sims 3, whenever I have a fish or... Like... Uh, one of the pets like this, like turtles or snakes or anything, or birds. I forgot to feed them, forget to feed them, and they all die. Every single one. So, I think in the next part, I will probably have her write two books of life off camera. That way, I'll have them ready for the baby and um, her next victim, which... Uh, I guess we'll just have to go out and see who we find first or go through her friends list. But I think it'd be uh, better to just go out and try to find someone. Emery's still alive though, so... Um, where's Alexandria? There she is. Okay, so she's still alive. Okay, so we've got the Book of Life. Let's go ahead and bind that to someone. Come on. Uh, capture Epic Saga. Uh, where is he? Right here, Anthony Bellow. So we'll do that after she pays her bills, which are 4,878 simoleons. And sugar skulls. I really love these. Sugar skulls. That one's my favorite, I think. Yeah. Yeah, that one's definitely my favorite. I wish there was like an all-white one or something. Or like a... I don't know. Maybe that mint color with white. That'd be pretty. But, you know whatever. I uh, should probably put the walls down a little bit. She shouldn't sit in this little Halloween chair. And I need to sell her stuff, but eh. Can't be bothered right now. How's her cow plant doing? Where is it? Is it there? Yeah. So, it's a great plant so far. So that's good. And I'm glad that I can actually hire a gardener to take care of my garden because yeah, I can't be bothered. So I'm just going to have her use the bathroom and eat some apple pie. And I guess we'll, we'll call it an episode, guys. Alright, so I guess that's it for this episode. I feel, I feel like I always either start or end with her either eating or writing. I'm going to go ahead and call it an episode. And the next part will be a little bit longer because it will be a Saturday video. And in the next part, I think uh, she'll probably have the baby. Well, not probably. She'll definitely have the baby in the next part. So feel free to leave some name suggestions in the comments below for girl or boy. Because I don't know if she's having. She could possibly have twins. Who knows? And we'll work towards finding her next victim. So that'll be a surprise because we don't know who we're going to find. But I'm going to have her go out and find someone new instead of just going through her friends list. Because I feel like it'd be more to do. And now she is leaving. Thank you. And goodbye. And I think I will have her work towards a new aspiration as well. So, that, uh, I don't need that anymore because I don't need Anthony anymore. He's going to die. And then hopefully, Emery will probably die in the next part. And we'll be able to plant her flower over here. So let me know which flower you think we should plant for her. Should we find a new flower? Should we just use one of the flowers we have? Which is a bluebell and a daisy and snapdragon and chrysanthemum and i think that's all yes okay so one of those and i guess she's gonna be playing it she's gonna troll to have full rooms and be crazy anyway thank you guys so much for watching please leave a like comment or subscribe if you like this episode and 
I will see you guys in the next part. Bye!